Three mushers made history over the weekend at the 30th annual Can-Am Crown International Sled Dog Race. For the first time ever, the winners of all three races were women. New Center Maine's Carly Dion was there this morning for the emotional moment when the last of them, the 250 mile race champion, crossed the finish line. New Brunswick native Catherine Longley, the 2023 Can Am 250 winner. And how does it feel? I have no words. <laughs> Making history as the first woman ever to win this race in 30 years. I, I don't think I've realized it yet. <laughs> It'll probably dawn on me tomorrow. This also marks the first time the winners of all three races are women. Uh, this weekend, it's women that, and Canadian women that came in uh, first place in the 30 and the 100 and myself in the 250. So yeah, I'm really, really happy. Longley's fight to the finish didn't come without challenges. It was uh, it was hot, so the dogs were, you know, basking in the sun and not eating very much. So I think all of us as mushers, we were wondering, huh, what's the next leg going to look like? Longley is no stranger to the Can-Am. She's been competing in the race for more than a decade. Two years ago, she placed second by less than a minute, and last year she scratched. So this year, she was determined. It definitely gave me a, an urge to, to try and uh, get to the finish line first. The trail wraps through forests, lakes, fields, and hills of the upper St. John Valley. 250 miles over 48 hours takes a toll on the mushers and, of course, their dogs. You work so hard from the beginning to the end of this race, and all of my muscles are done. All these years, Longley has been competing in the Can-Am alongside her partner, Remy LaDuke. We spoke with them ahead of the start of the race Saturday morning. LaDuke saying they came here with one goal in mind. We're, we're not here to lose. She's not here to lose. <laughs> it would be several hours before LaDuke crossed the finish line with his team. Longley anticipating his reaction. And he knew that I'm capable of it, so I think He's going to be very proud, but he's going to be, well, I knew it. <laughs> I promised her in 2017 that we would make her win the race. We would make her the first woman to win the race. Pr proud of her a lot, of my dog, myself. As for what's next for Longley, she tells me she's looking forward to a shower and some sleep. In Fort Kent, Carly Dion, New Center, Maine. Yeah, those would be top of the list yes, for right sure. Away. Good on those three women.